this is a video that perhaps shouldn't even be a video. This is about someone I know, personally, that continues to engage in behavior that I, time and time again, have tried to convince him. In fact, I would say he is convinced, but I've tried to encourage him to try to avoid it in my relationship with him. And he refuses to listen. I'm not going to divulge who this person is. So, I'm going to just put it out there and get it off my chest. And if anyone out there who's watching this does do the things that this person does, then perhaps you can sense my irritation with such and ponder if anyone you are that way towards might also find it irritating. And maybe there are those who can recognize what I'm saying as that there are people they know that do such, and maybe I can help there. So here goes. This individual tends to try to defend himself when I bring up something that they currently are doing or that they did a while ago that has hurt me, usually psychologically speaking. And this in spite of the fact that I continue to ask for an apology in place of trying to defend oneself. If you're trying to... If, if you are defensive, it's probably because you feel bad about what the issue is. And maybe you don't quite feel that you can apologize. Maybe you feel that it would... Maybe you're too proud to apologize. Maybe you don't feel... Whatever. But being defensive really doesn't help. It doesn't get us anywhere. So, if you feel like being defensive, maybe just consider, should I apologize in this situation? Or, and this one is important, am I even the one on trial here? Is this even something that I should be defending myself for? Is this scenario that is being talked about, is this subject even something where I'm being accused of something? Am I being asked to apologize, or are my actions in question at all? He interrupts when I say it. The way I talk in these videos is, in fact, pretty much how I talk in real life. And that is because I am used to him finishing my sentences, and this has been going on for as long as I can remember, and I recently have started to tell him that when he finishes my sentences, it distracts me from what I'm saying, because he usually, often at least, he often gets it wrong. He's, his guesses of what I'm about to say are not always what I'm about to say, and Granted, there are times where I need help in remembering what word or terminology or whatever, but I'll ask. I ask if I'm having so much trouble remembering that I need someone else's assistance in finding the word. Otherwise, I will make sure to finish my own sentences and That, that is one of the th things where he interrupts. Another is to be defensive, and in general just... or to elaborate excessively on something where I really don't need all the details, where we, we really don't need all the details. We don't need to go deep into details 
regardless of what we're talking about. If we already agree on something, if I know the details he's going to divulge, then there is no point in going deep into these details unless that is in fact what we're talking about. And often it isn't, and he will go into this great level of detail on something that really isn't perhaps not even the issue. He will, when we are tr trying to decide on the course of action, because I, it should be said, he is quite smart, and I sometimes get advice from him. He has this tendency, and I guess a lot of people maybe do, where he will criticize something we currently are not choosing. And this is just destructive to the process in the long run. This means that the next time he decides that the course of action that he criticized might be the best option, then I am completely against this option because of the criticisms. And this... it's not the fact that he changes his mind, it's the fact that he's spent so much energy convincing me that the op that option is the worst possible option, and then later he says it's either the best option or the only option. And if he just said we can maybe, maybe we'll decide later that that's what we'll be doing, then there wouldn't be this ill effect. Maybe that is the... Maybe those are the things, let me think. Those might be the things, so... I hope I've helped someone else as well. But regardless, this has been quite helpful for myself, so maybe that'll be good enough for this one.